Hello everyone, this is R43 Pro, it's a handheld game console that has a lot of retro classic emulators built into this. I would say around 25 em emulators uh, it has built in with tons of great games to choose from and a lot of childhood memory games as well. I will show you. Now this handheld game console is the latest one uh, that's come out, R43 Pro. Uh, it has a much wider uh, design to it, so it fits much um, comfortably on your palm of your hands. At the back here, it has these raised bits here to give you that extra comfort when while you're holding this. And it also has the buttons here, so they go the L L1 and L2, R1 and R2 here. So easy to press the buttons, and it's very com comfortable to hold as well. Um, analog, the button layout is more designed like an Xbox controller, this one. The screen is much wider and uh, it has uh, a screen size of a 4.3 inch HD screen. The switch on button is at the bottom here. And you got the home button, select, start, volume control here. You got the navigation um, analogs here. You got the buttons here as well. Uh, underneath here takes the memory card. To, that has all the games and it can also save games it has a 3.5 millimeters headphone jack a USB type C charging port to charge this up and it does charge up pretty quickly um, on the right on the left it doesn't really have anything else at the top nothing but very comfortable um, game console you can get in different colors as well I've got this transparent um, um, design a black transparent uh, design but you can get it in other colors as well uh, so other features, it does have a high sensitivity, it also has 4000 mAh battery capacity, so it does have a big battery life built into this, so you can use it for a longer uh, period of time with one full charge. It has 2 gig system memory, 64 gig storage, and you can also increase that to 128 gig. Now let's try this out, um, these are PSP, and they got arcade game, you got uh, Final Burn, you got Mame, Atari, Atari, okay, different uh, different type of thing. So this is Atari 2600, Atari uh, 5200, Atari 7800, um, Atari Lynx, um, Capcom, um, uh, PS1, Capcom, PS2, Capcom, PS3, you got PC Engine, you got Entertainment System, you got Nesh, you got Game Boy, you got SFC, you got Super Nintendo, it's got N64, and Game Boy Color, Game Boy, um, Advance, it also has Sega Genesis, Game Gear, Mega Drive, Neo Geo Pocket, you got PlayStation 1, and it goes back to all the games, and you got PSP games as well. Now, one thing I love about this handheld game console is that you've got the options to press uh, the Y button, which is this one, and it goes straight to Quick Search. Now, it's a lot easier than other game handheld game consoles where you have to navigate through to find specific games. Whereas here, I can just type in, for example, Pokemon. Let me try Pokemon. Pokemon was one of my favorite childhood games, including a lot of PlayStation 1 games as well. Pokemon. Let's see how many. And this one has a lot of Pokemon games. So you can see you got Pokemon Blue ver uh, version, Red, Yellow version. Uh, you got Blue version again. You got Red version. You got the 10th anniversary distribution. You got Pokemon Aura uh, Mew distribution. You got Mew Pokemon Aurora um, ticket distribution. Pokemon Emerald. You got Fire Red version, Leaf Green version, uh, Leech Berry. I've never played that one, but yeah, you got that. You got Ruby version, Sapphire version. You got Mystery Dungeon. You got Pokemon Pinball, Crystal version, Gold. That was one of my favorite game i think that was my first game that i actually played the pokemon gold and i, I used to love that one i got pokemon silver pinball usa and you can see there's a few other ones i got pokemon stadium as well um a lot of games to choose from and uh you know i just love this the fact that you pay around just 50 pounds and you got all the games built in take this wherever you go and all the games also get saved as well so you, wh whichever game you choose you could put it as a favorite as well you got x tip to put it as a favorite and yeah so let's try um ridge racer 4 okay let's see how that game goes now this is just, just a nice um, handheld game console and uh, you know the quality of this one is amazing it's much more comfortable so it doesn't give you that ache when you're using it 
big screen and we can go loud, go loud volume as well okay so namco let's start so let's see how this is so i'm just going to i just want to just try out how the game is so i'm going to just choose um versus battle oh did i press back where it is okay no started okay let's see how this goes um you got street fighter you got tekken to choose from Bear in mind, some games may have it in a different language, and you won't be able to change it. But that's a, that's a few games. Go back. Oh, did I choose a different one now? Oh my. Okay, let's try it now. So I want to go to the actual gameplay. I can just try this game out. Ridge Race of a uh, Type Four. Okay, start. No. Um. Oh my days! I haven't even played this. This is my first time playing. Okay. Let, I'm just gonna try a different game. I haven't really tried this. I just picked out any games randomly. But let's try out a different one. Um. Uh, look, you got WWE SmackDown 2 as well. That's another game that I remember playing. You got Mortal Kombat 4, Bloody Raw. Let's just play Bloody Raw for now and let's check, see how that goes. But you see everything when you press the start it gives you the options to save the game and let's see so uh so let's try let's try arcade this is bloody raw that's not even so this one really does this one doesn't have any background um song Okay, and let's try out one more game. So this is just a fighting game. Um, let's try. Let's see if there is a Crash Bandicoot. No, you should have Crash Bandicoot. Normally it does. Okay, it does have it. So let's try this one out and see how this one goes. Okay, so hope you like the video review and the gameplay of this handheld game console. So please do give a like and subscribe.